Hello guys, okay, I'm back. This is, as I said, <clears throat> Magic Lace Curved Heart MLC 174. Okay, I didn't have a problem with the other one that they made, which was a little thinner and a little shorter. I didn't have a problem with that. I don't have a really big problem with this. There's nothing wrong with the construction of the wig, nothing wrong with the way they made her. She's really thick, there's plenty of hair. She has sort of a yakky texture to her. The only problem that I have is that I don't think she's a good fit for me because I don't like this curve, you know, the way you have to wear it, this is the only way. And, you know, this going across here, in order to keep this very heavy hair here out of my face, I'd have to be ingenious and use a barrette. So that's why I showed you guys uh, me doing that. Okay, so I'm gonna put that in so that I can talk to you throughout the rest of the video without doing this. Okay, so she is a bob. She is uh, curved. I'm probably the third person that has decided to get this color and do a review in it. So you're seeing it uh, for the third time if you haven't, if you've already seen this type of video. Okay, so she is a bob. All right, and this is how she looks. This is the other side. Okay, uh, one thing about it, it answered my question. I had a question about this unit when I first saw it, and my question was, does this unit show the tracks in the back? Because sometimes with blonde wigs, if they're not constructed as well in the back as in the front, then the tracks will show and everybody will know that it is a wig. Okay, well, I took a look at it myself from the back, and they did an excellent job. There's no tracks showing. I mean, unless you guys see it from the back, and you, you can tell me if you saw the tracks, but I didn't see any, so that's a good thing. The other con that I have about this wig for me is that this is it. I mean, I didn't realize that if you wear this, it has to stay in the front. It's going to stay in the front, because if you do it like this in the back... Uh, that'll work, but not from behind. You see what I'm saying? So you're kind of in an obligatory situation where you simply must wear it this way. Sorry. Okay, sorry for that. I had a slight interruption there. Okay, but anyway, yeah, the thing about this unit, if you get this unit, the way it looks is how you have to wear it. Uh, unless you want to cut it, which I'm not going to do, but unless you want to do that, you'd be working really hard to try to even it up with the rest of the wig in the back and I find that hard to do. And this is very thick. It's a very thick uh, head of hair. I can say that much. Okay, and I will put the price in the description box because uh, Lord knows I, I got my money's worth, that's for sure. And it is good to put a little something here in the part. You, you guys know you, you pretty much have to do that. And to wear some really funky earrings would be cool, but uh, there's so much hair that whatever earrings you wear, you're not going to see them, see? You know, I move my head like that. <laughs> I don't know. I've never had a bob like this, and uh, I kind of think I should have got it in the black color. Uh, well, actually, the reason why I didn't, because they were sold out. So this was left, and I thought, well, I'm, I've had it in blonde, so I'll just get it in blonde again. And that's what I did, but a barrette is definitely going to be in order, guys, unless you know how to do this all day, and it doesn't bother you. It bothers me. Other than that, I have no problem with this unit. I love the way they made her. They did a very good job. Uh, if they made a long blonde wig down to my navel like this, not bob, but, you know, just long and straight, I would be in heaven. I would have her. Okay. Anyway, hope you guys like her. I'm trying to get used to her so thanks so much for watching don't forget to comment and subscribe and like and share and all that good stuff and uh let me know if this is a yay or a nay okay and you better say yay i'll never talk to you again all right <laughs> bye guys